The Joker is troubled in a wicked villain who is the nemesis of Batman. His age is not known, but he looks to be in his late 40s to early 50s. He is a male that has brown eyes and sandy light green hair. He does not have a socially normal job, but some might think that running the streets with thugs is a normal job. He spends the majority of his time planning on how to kill Batman while destroying Gotham in the process. The only goals in the Joker's life is to destroy Batman and everything in his path. The health is not mentioned in the movie, but he does not look healthy. He has scars on both sides of his mouth, making a permanent look of a smile. Psychologically, he appears to be suffering from antisocial personality disorder. This is clearly seen by his rushed behavior and disregard for others. He does not have a relationship with his parents or relatives. The only social relationship he does have are those with thugs and delinquents. There is no evidence of drugs or alcohol use, but he reports that his father was an abusive alcoholic. He copes by hurting people and then running before facing the consequences. Antisocial personality disorder shows disregard for the law and others starting around the age of 15 and indicated by the three of the following. Failure to follow social norms, deceitfulness, impulsive behavior and failure to plan, irritability and aggressiveness, reckless disregard for safety of self of others, consistent as responsibility and lack of remorse. The individual is at least age of 18. This is evidence of conduct disorder with onset before age 15. Antisocial personality disorder is considered to be a chronic illness in which an individual's manner of thinking, perceiving situation, and empathizing with others is deemed morally wrong in his or her society. They have disdain for society rules. They know right from wrong, but they simply do not care. They appear insufficient in their ability to experience, share, or repical emotions such as guilt or love. The most essential diagnosis feature of antisocial personality disorder is perceiver disregard for the violation of the rights of others. Antisocial personality disorder is also sometimes called psychopathy or psychopathic personality disorder. Normally, individuals suffer from antisocial personality disorder will display a pattern of lying, stealing, running away from home, and having difficulty upholding the law. They also tend to have problem with the abuse of illicit drugs and alcohol. And here we go. Failure to conform to social norms with respect to lawful behaviors as indicated by repeatedly performing acts that are grounds for arrest. Drop the now. Drop what? The weapon. I'm sorry. What do you want? I just want my phone call. <laughs> All right. See you, the Joker is gone. Would Lau? The Joker planned to be caught. He wanted me to lock him up in the MCU. Deceitfulness is shown by repeatedly lying, use of aliases, or conning others for personal profit or pleasure. You and your friends are dead! He's out, right? Where did you learn to count?
That's a lot of money. If this Joker guy was so smart, he'd have had us bring a bigger car. I'm betting the Joker told you to kill me as soon as we loaded the cash. No, 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 no. I killed the bus driver. Bus driver? What bus driver? School's out. Time to go. The guy's not getting up, is he? That's a lot of money. What happened to the rest of the guys? Think you're smart, huh? Pull the guy that hired you. They'll just do the same to you. Oh, criminals in this town used to believe in things. Honor. Respect. Look at you. What do you believe in, huh? What do you believe in? I believe whatever doesn't kill you simply makes you a stranger. Impulsive behavior or failure to plan ahead. Irritability and aggressiveness as indicated by repeated physical fights or assaults. My jokes were bad. Give me one reason why I shouldn't have my boy here pull your head off. How about a magic trick? I'm gonna make this pencil disappear. Ta -da! It's... it's gone. Drop the gun. Oh. Sure, you just take off your little mask and show us all who you really are. Reckless disregard for safety of self or others. Let her go. Very poor choice of words. <laughs> Consistent irresponsibility as indicated by repeated failure to sustain consistent work behavior or honor financial obligations. Where's the Italian? With your good man. What do you do with all your money? You see, I'm a guy of simple taste. I enjoy uh, dynamite, gunpowder, and gasoline. What's this? Ah, that, that, that. And you know the thing that they have in common? They're cheap. Sergio Romano Silver. Oh, I am. I'm only burning my half. 
All you care about is money. This town deserves a better class of criminal. And I'm gonna give it to them. Tell your men they work for me now. This is my city. They won't work for a freak. freak. Why don't we cut you up into little pieces and feed you to your pooches? Hmm? And then we'll see how loyal a hungry dog really is. It's not about money. It's about sending a message. Everything burns. Lack of remorse, as indicated by being indifferent to or rationalizing having hurt, mistreated, or stolen from another. So which of you fine gentlemen would like to join our team? Oh, there's only one spot open right now, so we're gonna have tryouts. Make it fast. I want my phone call. I want it. I want it. I want my phone call. That's nice. How many of your friends have I killed? <sighs> I'm a 20 year man, and I know the difference between punks who need a little lesson in manners and the freaks like you who would just enjoy it. And you killed six of my friends. How about a lie? Conduct disorder can be indicated by childhood abuse. Look at these scars. My father was a drinker and a fiend. And one night, he goes off crazier than usual. Mommy gets the kitchen knife to defend herself. He doesn't like that. Not one bit. So, me watching, he takes the knife to her, laughing while he does it. He turns to me and he says, why so serious? He comes at me with the knife. Why so serious? He sticks the blade in my mouth. Let's put a smile on that face. And... Why so serious? The occurrence of antisocial behavior is not exclusive during the course of schizophrenia or a manic episode. The Joker's behavior was consistently out of the norm. His ruthless behavior was continual for long durations of time, so the presence of a manic episode would be unlikely. The problems the Joker displays are evident. The Joker does not like anything to do with justice and peace and absolutely hates Batman. However, sometimes he seems to enjoy him. It seems that the Joker hates everything about himself as well, since he has to hurt others around him to make himself feel better. His only purpose in life is to destroy Gotham for no apparent reason and to destroy Batman since he is always in the Joker's way to destruction. He also wants to corrupt Harvey Dent, cause mass chaos, and get Batman to break his one rule. He kills and hurts others for fun and for no clear reason. The Joker wanted humans to understand that they were bad and destroyers when all the while he was the one committing crimes. The Joker does not express any empathy for his cruel actions along with being sadistic. He completely and knowingly disregards laws and social norms of society as a whole, all of which are related to antisocial personality disorder. Antisocial personality disorders is difficult to treat because the individual does not believe that they need treatment. The Joker would need long-term treatments in a structured and residential setting where he could not hurt others. Since the Joker has never had a healthy relationship, psychotherapy and behavior modification will help, even by developing a relationship with his therapist. The Joker has a few suicide attempts and may be suffering from depression. An antidepressant may help his depression and irritability. Though an antidepressant does not treat the individual for antipersonality disorder, it will help with the comorbid conditions.